I'm standing in front of a Leadwell multi-axis turning centre. This machine, or the model of this machine, is the LTC 25i SMY. It's a sub-spindle, mill-drill, Y-axis machine. It is a really chunky, heavy-duty machine, this one. Uh, in fact, at the show this week, it's been, uh, been one of my highlights when I'm looking at multi-axis turning. What I do like about it as well is opening the doors. You actually open both doors here. So you've got, you've got a very clear access. In fact, that door goes back a bit even further. So when you're talking about loading a multi-axis machine, you're right in there, right at, you know, right at the chuck height. Very, very ergonomic. Now we've got two spindles, and they look like equal spindles on the front there and then on, on the back of the machine as well. You're talking about a 10-stroke, 12-inch chuck machine. We've got a 12-station turret, and every station on this turret can have driven tools. The Y-axis on this machine is actually plus or minus 50 mil, so you've got a lot of scope for your off-center milling and drilling. You've got 3,500 RPM on the main spindle, and it is actually around about a 76 or 77 mil bar capacity machine. So it's a big machine, it is a big turning center, multi-axis function. Leadwell in the UK are sold by Lead Precision Machine Tools. They have some phenomenal success in selling their two-axis lathes, three-axis lathes. This is the next step, really. This takes, this takes factories into a more automated environment. And whether you're machining aluminium, steels, difficult materials, you can see by the, the sheer size and weight of this machine that it is capable of handling the most difficult of components. You've got a swarf convert. I mean, swarf fallaway as well is, is a big point when you're producing swarf. The fallaway is great. It's into the swarf conveyor and out the back of the machine. Now, what I am gonna do again now is I'm gonna shut these doors because it's quite important to also see that when the doors are shut, the control function to the window. I do like the fact we've got a very big window there and the control panel is very accessible uh, or the view is very accessible from the control panel. We've also got a parts bin, a parts catcher, a tool setting, um, and also, they paid a lot of attention to detail on this uh, conveyor here as well. Very well positioned and ideal for when you're looking to offload components off of the machine or doing a production run. So it isn't the smallest of turning centres, but that's for a reason, because it's heavy duty. It's built to last. It has been a big highlight for us uh, this week at the show. It has been machining some rather tricky components as well. So this Leadwell multi-axis machine, they're available from Lead Precision Machine Tools in the UK. This is a fairly new model, but I'm sure you'll be seeing a lot of these in the field.